So here guys, this is the basic set of the Druid. I will explain to you what cards you have and what they do. So just to give you a decent idea of what the game is about. The first card, Innervate. It, when activated, it gains two mana crystals just for one round. So after one round, you're back to your basic mana crystal amount just for one turn. Moonfire. <clears throat> Pretty basic spell. Costs zero mana and deals one damage. It's good to use some time, but not extremely well, of course. Claw. Cost one mana. Pretty decent card. Gives you hero to attack for just one turn and two armor for every turn. Mark of the Wild. I like these kind of cards because they give you a attack and health bonus and a pretty decent one, plus two, plus two. So it's a pretty decent card. Wild Growth. I really like these kind of cards. They can really give you an advantage uh, if in the start of the game because it gives you one extra mana potion every round from the moment you activate it. When you activate it, it's empty, so uh, you can't effectively use the mana potion in the round you use it, but it will fill up the next round. Healing Touch restores a lot of health to whatever car character you want. So either a minion or your hero can be good, especially in endgame if you have if you don't have a lot of health and you just need that advantage to your opponent. Savage Roar costs three mana potions. Uh, just for one turn, the turn you activate it, it gives your characters two attack. So in the next round, it's already gone. Pretty decent card. Swipe, four mana potions. This can be really effective if you have a full board or a nearly full board with enemies and you kind of can get them uh, to a low health. And with this card, you can wipe out four, five, or more enemies just with one card. Just use it on your most healthy opponent, and you're up, you're up for a win. Two more cards for the Druid. One costs six. It's a uh, you can choose if you use this card on a minion or on a hero. It deals immediately 5 damage and after you use it, you automatically draw a new card. So it's pretty expensive, but it can help you in some kind of situations. Especially if you have a low health uh, enemy hero at the end of your turn. A taunt card with which costs you 8 mana potions. I really like this card, but uh, yeah, it's, the problem is most of the times when I used it, this, uh, my opponent annoyingly turns it into a sheep or any low kind of low level minion. So if you use these kind of cards, high level cards, try to lure your enemy out to use those kind of cards first before you try and use this kind of card. It's an incredibly strong card and especially when you can use some extra buffs on it to make it even stronger you can take out the enemy very fast. I hope you enjoyed this small review of the basic card set of the Druid. Hope it helps for you beginners out there.